Hello. Hi, Tracy. Does it? I, I kind of washed it and I did curl it. I used my shark curl thing. I actually got off the couch and had a shower just to curl my hair. I don't know if you can see it or not. But it's, it's so broken. Like, you should see it. Like, all the baby hairs. I lost my two. Did you see them? Hmm. I didn't think you could. Hello. So I kind of did my base because like, this video might be very long. I don't know. I honestly don't know. I think it might be the... Um, the Dream Queen... Dream Cream from Charlotte Tilbury. I have no idea. I know it's, I am breaking out a little bit because I got my period, but my nose is so like in here, it's all broken out. Look what I got yesterday. I haven't even smelled it yet. I got this one. Um, no, I don't. <laughs> Oh, I do like that one. I used the rest of my um, gift card from Kelly. And it's funny because I have this one down here. Okay, I will. <laughs> yeah, and I don't like a whole lot of scents, but I was like, I'm going to get that one. Um, okay, so I thought I'd go over what I won on from Shoppers. Because there's a few people that don't have a... Yes, I uh, I like this one. Oh, my um, F the rest of my Jeffree Star stuff shipped. Sorry, guys. I don't know what's going on. I've been up since six. I'm tired. Um, okay, and I got my Timu. Um, oh, my fingers hurt. I lost the nails to them today because they were ripping. So I thought I'd just cut them. And then, yeah, now they're, they're super short, so they're hurting. And I just jabbed them, and they're really hurting, though. Um, okay, so I need to take that upstairs with me. Um, so, yeah. So I kept everything, just because people, um, I, I think there's one or two people that emailed me and said they don't have um, Instagram, so I thought I'd show one here what this was, what I won, but I'll do it in a little bit. Um, I got a Timu order. Um, I did get this, which you guys just saw. Um, it smells really, really nice. I really like that. But I thought we start with just doing a look. Um, That's awesome. I saw you did a large order. I just did a bunch of $15 orders. Like I did three of them and they were late packing them. They were late this, that. So I got like $30 in credit from them. So yeah. Um, and then one other order has been late. So I've gotten about 40 some dollars in credit. So yeah, I'm not gonna, gonna complain about that. Okay. I need just to do a purple look. I just need to do a purple look. I thought I'd do something colorful, but right now I just want to do a purple look. Huh. 
You ordered last night and it's out for delivery already? Uh, from Timu? There's no way. Mine always tastes like a week. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm. I'm gonna do purple with a bit of the green. Yeah, I know. That's just that's crazy. Mine is never that quick. So I did all the basics. Um, I used the Elf glow. I just used a little bit, like the tiniest amount, just on my forehead, on my cheeks, and stuff. Um, I did use actually, um, right now I'm really, oh, that's good. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So I thought you meant like it, it was out for delivery, not shipping, but yeah, I've had, um, a few of them like ship quickly, but then they just get stuck. There, I thought they said they had a warehouse in Canada, but they, all of my stuff is still flown in, which is like, I don't know. So I use this, and then I use this, plus my per my pink setting powder. So I'm just going to go in with the purple. And then I'm using the Jason Wu um, eye primer. Yeah, I totally read that wrong. Yeah, my stuff, um, I don't know if it's coming from the U.S. My, some of the stuff now, but I know that some of this other stuff, it was not coming from the U.S. because it was being flown in. Look how pretty this purple is. This is ice cream drip. Yeah, I've done a couple of things. I will say that one of my favorite things from them is this. And my little um, brush, brush washing machine. I'm gonna go in with taste like me. My dog is on the uh, couch. I don't know if you can see her. Yeah, see. Did you? What are you doing, Sass? Um, I went in with the um, Elf Glow, and then, um, oddly enough, I just went in with the um, Doll 10. This covers everything. And then I used the Elf Contour. I did not use the blush, because I'm going to use the Jeffree Star blush, but I'm not going to put on as much as I did last night. We need, don't need a repeat of last night. That was crazy. Yes. Definitely learned my lesson. So I'm actually gonna go in with the cotton candy party. This bluey color and just <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I was like, holy crap. Um, I will say that it's really nice having access to Super Great because now I just buy one or two things from Doll 10 on there and everything gets shipped UPS and it's basically overnight and it's free. So I'm not going to lie. I like that. I'm not going to say too much because I don't want them catching on and then not shipping anything through. Yeah, so. I kind of like, you can kind of see the bit of the, the blue there. Kind of. I'm gonna go in with gourmet, gourmet glory. I gotta dig. I gotta do a really, really colorful look on this. I just have to work up. I think I'm not gonna do it live because it's just I know I'm gonna have a lot of things to fix. I think I found my new favorite purple though. Look at that. Yep. Um, is it? It's the one in the trio, right? So I've tried all of their skincare, and I have to say, like, all of her, their skincare is really nice. I found that my skin was, and I, I'm pretty sure it's part of the reason why my skin is more balanced than ever. Um, sorry, Andre, that's what she said there. It is. So this one here says. Castle, Castle Sprinkles. Look at look how gorgeous that is. It's this one here. Like it's got all different colors in it. It may be. Um, I know it's an older item. I think. I think. Anyway, I know there's one that's in the. I have to look, but I'm pretty sure it's the one I have used. I really like their the one in the pump. It is my favorite. It's the overnight um, enzy enzyme. Maybe that's the one I'm thinking of. Maybe that's the one you're th talking about. Hello. So, I know some of you, I'm just going to see if I can put this down. Oh, no, no, too low. That's too low. Okay, so, thank you. I actually really liked it too, and then I was like, I just went to like bed with it, and I was like, ugh. But it was well worth doing it yesterday. Um, I had to do a look anyway, because, yeah. There's no way I was letting it sit. So, is it like the pump? No, I'm thinking of the resurfacing. I'll have to look. I'll have to look. Um, so, I know um, when... I'm not sure how many of you guys looked into getting anything from the Cotton Candy series um, from Jeffree Star, but... I wasn't told that... that the one thing that I really wanted was going to be delayed. So I'm going to message, I was going to message them and be like, like, where's the rest of my product? You know, and I might still, um, 
but it shipped today, which is, you know, not the 15th. And re weirdly enough, um, I looked yesterday to see where my tracking for my Jeffree Star was, and it didn't update. Did not update whatsoever. So um, I was really pleasantly surprised when I went to go get my mail, and there it is, right? So I'm like, what the heck is going on here? Whatever. It worked out. That is a really pretty color. I'm actually going to take this brain candy. And I'm just going to, I want to add it to the middle. I, I, well, I'll say that blush really, um, really kind of pulled it in the whole look. So the last video I did, um, not well, I shouldn't say the last video, but one of the videos I did, I, um, you guys could clearly tell, like I was just not having a good, good enough time. I want to say good enough time, but it wasn't like that. It was, um, I'm actually gonna go in with, I think the cotton candy party here. So I did this the same thing, but I used the Elf the last time. But I find that the Elf is the same, almost the same shade as this one as the makeup I wear with Doll Ten. But it's it's light or fair light or whatever it is. But I find it a little dark. So I'm going in with the the blue for the under eye here. Um, I'm really loving the new concealer I got, the Rose Court one. a bit of fun with this one and don't ask me why my nose is running right now because it's been fine all day actually it's never been better I haven't been um blowing my nose or anything lately oh no it's okay Martine I'm sorry I was just just kind of going over what I what I've done. This yellow, I want to do one look with the yellow, and that's it. Right. So since I've been using my sleep machine, my nose has been a lot better. Like I'm not getting as many like bloody noses. I'm not finding gunk in there. I'm not blowing my nose all day. I'm not yawning, which is really freaking nice. Oh, by the way, I lost my headphones because I'm, I'm so mad at myself right now. Are we hearing the same static? Because I cleaned out the ports and I'm thinking that may help be helping. But let me know. I'm going to go in with this confetti sky. Okay. So that one video, I had so many people complaining, and I'm like, oh, guys. We are going to do a secret word. Clicking? Okay. So my daughter gave me um, AirPods, and I'm, like, trying to find them, but I cannot, for the life of me, find them. I wonder what the clicking is. Okay. Okay. 
You guys, can you see the blue that I added there? Isn't that a really nice blue sheen to it? I love it. So I'm actually going to go in with the Clinique one. Um, I have retired all of my Jeffree Star ones for, for good reason. They were past their expiry date. So, yeah. I'm not going to curl my lashes today. But I really like this one. And this is one of the products I won. Um, oddly enough, I went and I kept one of the... Um, what is it? Uh, what the, oh, this. So I kept this from my um, makeup sample bags. And then I won it. So one is actually now in the makeup giveaway. And I found this to be a really nice, beautiful nude. I actually tried it on and I really liked it. But we're not wearing it today. So my four, four big treats are coming and I bet you they're all gonna be palettes that I have. So, sorry guys, I don't know what happened there. I know you've been in an all, a lull, uh, Martine, so I'm really glad to hear that. Um, what did you win it on? Can you wanna, do you want to share with us what you won it on? Okay, guys, I'm not sure what's going on. I don't know if it's the makeup or the fact that I've gotten better. I'm sorry if you can see I'm wandering around there. Or if it's this Jason Wu eye primer. But I think this is some of the best eyeshadow I've had from Jeffree Star. I've got literally no fallout. It, like, look how well it blended. And like, even here, like you can see that it's really blended. I noticed that with the pink, it blended really well. Like it was meant to. So like, like I said, I don't know. And I don't want to put eyeliner on because like I have really bad, um, what are they called? Hooded eyes. Um, so I'm not going to, I will say that I'm really surprised at the packaging on this because it is like a cardboard. Martine, it must be so hard sometimes because like the first word that you put there, totally my mind went very dirty. <laughs> and it's probably something like you said, circle, or whatever it is. But yeah, no, my mind went dirty. But I will say that this is really nice. It's a heavy cardboard. And I will say that um, like the magnet is very strong in it. So yeah. So even though it's like a cardboard, do you, okay, I'm not trying to, but that's like, I'm just, yeah. I think this palette might be one of my favorites. I hate to say it, but I also, if you notice, oh no, you can't really see it. So behind the, oh, huh. So that's the name of the store. So, huh, that's kind of neat. Okay, so this thing is huge, like,
Okay. You know, you'd think I would have remembered that, but nope. I have a hair stuck in my face. Huh. So, that's kind of weird. That is so weird. I will say this is like one of my favorite, favorite blushes with the Fenty one that I have for cream. No, you and Tracy remembering your French. I just went somewhere very dirty. I do not get to be included in this. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Guys, so tip. Do not put that on your face. Make sure you put it on your hand or on your blush, on your br brush, brush. But yes, it is super pretty, super, super pretty. So I'm gonna go in with this highlighter though. So, yeah, yeah, uh, I, I have to do one with the yellow. I want to do just a yellow look because, like, this is so soft and so pretty. Like, I can't believe how soft it is. And, like, I could wear this, like, to work, you know, if I wanted to and, and elsewhere. Um, you can kind of see the blue at the bottom, which kind of just gives it enough pop. Like, I'm kind of stunned by this. Okay, guys. The, the, the moment you've been waiting for. This, I was telling the girls at work today that this made me look like an 80s street worker. <laughs> but this purple was really nice. And then adding this on was really, really pretty. But I thought maybe I could do, like, all three. But, like, kind of do, like, a funny, fancy lip. I don't know. I hate to ruin the whole look, but I mean, I can wipe it off and start over again. Yeah. I'm even noticing that the names were a little more, like, kind of fine-tuned. There are a couple there that I was like, oh, God, is... Okay. I'm not mad about that color. As weird as that sounds. Although, totally not me, but I thought, you know what? <laughs> I 
I see that. Yes, I'm going to probably go over all this with the purple, but I just want to... Cut them. Of Yeah, it kind of looks a little bit better that way, right? Like, you can kind of still see the hint of the blue, but it looks more purple and have a little more fun with it that way. So last night when I went to bed, I washed my face, right? I didn't take any many benefit products upstairs, but... Um... I kind of like the hints of the blue sticking out. What do you guys think? Like, kind of having them swirling in together. I think that's kind of neat. My fingers hurt. So this is the one I got. And I was like, this is really bright, right? Oh, I just put that in there, didn't I? But... Okay, so the group that, I'm not going to really name the group that I'm part of, but there's a group that I'm part of, and there's, there is somebody that, she likes to post over deals, and that's great, don't get me wrong, but I, and I don't post my videos there very often, just because I don't need to, I, I like post, I just post them on my Facebook, and that's it, right, then I'm done, right, not a big deal, so anyway, um, I went and I posted Mar May Marches because Marches was Mar March was a decent box. I thought I'd way. And I really enjoyed it. So anyway, um, she she commented something about the nail polish saying that she can get it for $2. And it's always a off for her to get top box because she always gets that. And it's not fair sort of thing. And I'm like, okay, well, you know, I get what you're saying. But, uh, you know. I hate when you're happy that you got something and then somebody else isn't happy that, you know, it's in their top box, which I totally, I totally get, you know, but at the same time, I guess I can see some of my highlights now, but it's like, let me have that little piece of happiness. Like, but anyway, um, she commented again on, the, on my March's box because somebody else had commented wondering if that box was still available. I'm like, oh. So I was kind of surprised she didn't comment on this month's box. Which kind of is nice. Um, so I just wanted to let you know that I got this one size ultimate setting powder with my perfume. And I'm going to put this in my makeup giveaway box. Um, I moved it so um, I did top box is a subscription um, it's Canadian scripture box it's $15 it is such a hit and a miss Andy it is such a hit and a miss this month was spectacular absolutely amazing um, the video I put out yesterday if you want to go back like after this you can watch it 
Um, I got, actually I have this four items right here. So you can't get this month's box. I always mention that in the video, no matter how good this month's box is, don't rush to sign up. If you don't have the $15 to blow, don't do it. I will say that much about it. If you like being so mad at a box, you can throw it across the room. Go for it. Absolutely. Go for it. But it's like up and down, up and down, up and down. Um, a lot of products that you get in are like from Masquerade, which is Canadian. And I don't mind Masquerade. Masquerade has some really nice products. Um, the other one is La Ritzy. Um, La Ritzy... I got mixed emotions about because it is a Canadian uh, company. It's just that I think they they just um, have their stuff made in. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm I. I have such I hate, love and hate with Ipsy, but it's not because my boxes are super shitty. It's because I rarely get the box that I am promised. <laughs> so, okay. So I'll show you quickly. Um, I think last month I got some poor professional stuff too. So the, there's new benefit stuff. So I, I, I believe I got the mask. Yeah, it's it, the the $10 add-on. Though that one can be absolutely spectacular. A lot of people got the OA um, OE, uh, perfume. And yeah, others didn't my beauty markup city i'm really loving this blush guys usually i'm really bad with blush and i don't like it but i find this one actually really natural but anyway so i got the smooth sip i was looking for a moisturizer because i had a shower and i didn't put on my face stuff i don't because i'm gonna have wash my face again and there's no sense in doing it so yeah um yeah the tube i've completely forgot about the tube the tube was a lot of fun. So I did um, order the mystery box because you guys really seem to like me ordering those. And I don't mind wasting my money on that because a lot of it goes into the giveaways. And I get so many views from it. So it's it's, a, it's just a investment for me. Um, I will say, um, Andy, um, keep your eye on the look, look good feel better website they have some really good boxes on there at christmas my fiance got me the high-end one and it came with a charlotte tilbury um dream cream and it came with a nars palette it came with um, a muggler perfume it, it was just spectacular it was like a 200 hundred dollar box for like 150 or something it was crazy it was well worth it, but you knew everything that was coming in it. There was no surprises, which is kind of nice. So I also got this one. So I do have the um, the oil base, the oil emulsion one, and Magic Dream Love. Is that what it's called? Uh, it's just the Dream Cream. I call it. <laughs> hey, you know, I used to watch YouTubers. If you can't call it the right thing, then why are you calling it? So here I am. Yeah. Because I have too, too many other things on my mind. I don't know. And there's another one, guys. Um, if you really, really like being adventurous, do the... Um, it's a magic cream. That's right. It's not the dream cream. It's magic cream. That's why I have you around, Andrea, because... You're like my Sonia at work. Sonia finishes my sentences all the time at work. It's hilarious to a point. I do feel bad for her and I do thank her a lot because she speaks Roxanne fluently. But anyway, I also got this. Um, oh, and the look good and feel, feel good. Um, it also supports women who are in um, um, cancer situations. I totally just screwed that up. I'm sorry. Um, the don the money made from it the profits made for it go into programs for women fighting cancer so um they have some really spectacular boxes um i do try to buy them because they're good for you for good for charities and good for me because give me stuff i like to use that sounds really bad but um but yeah and then whatever i don't use i put in my boxes and like 
yeah, there's some really nice stuff. So yeah, um, this one um, was retails for $51. I will say that I've got almost the whole keys line, and then I got really mad at myself because I, um, I'm sorry. Um, Zoe, I sent Zoe the, the key stuff. Um, so I, but it's okay. Cause I'm not going to use it because I have this Clinique stuff, but I am going to probably keep this one. Um, I'm not sure. I may put it in a giveaway later on because I do have the Fenty one and I'm still using the, um, glow one. And I kind of want to use those too. So it just depends on how, uh. Yeah. Oh, does it doesn't expire till 25, 2025. So I do. So I have some time. Okay, good. Cause this is huge. This is huge. So, um, yeah, it was $51. So if you sign up for top box now, you will not get this box. Unfortunately, you will have to wait till next month. And like I said, likely next month might be trash. So I'd wait till the month after <laughs> and then sign up. And then of course I got clearance. Um, I did call them at my video cause they are so bad. Like I have two hand samples, but seriously. These are crazy. Yes. Post your information here. Are you uh, collecting pledges or anything like that, Andy? So, um, I don't know. Um, I know a lot of people were saying um, that their shoppers drug mart weren't doing as much as the one in List World. I will tell you, the one in List World was amazing. So, she kept up with it. Oh, I forgot. I did get something else. Those four items were in top box, yeah. So uh, this month was a rare month, so do not base your decision on this month. Do me a favor. Um, if you have some time, go back to my videos. I mean, you can put me on mute um, and just watch what I get and my face because it's kind of funny. My face tells it all. You don't even have to listen to me. Um, so I went to pick up my prize, and they had um, a punch thing for $3, so I did that because, you know, I apparently like giving shoppers beauty mingle my money because I think I spent about 50, 60, 70 dollars. All the money was going to good things. So that's why I'm, I did it. Um, okay, so I totally want to keep this and I may because then I can put like my um, sunscreen stuff in there. But so I got, oh, the different fragrances, which I do not, will not keep. So those are going in my jar. So if you are Canadian and you win one of my giveaways, I will put some stuff in there. I believe I put some good girl. Um, they had uh, the red one uh, of this in the big one, which I didn't win, but that's okay. Yeah, this is. <laughs> no, just because sometimes I lose my words and I find that I'm a lot better, a lot more on track this live than I probably was the last one because I'm actually getting sleep. I've got my CPAP machine and totally different feeling. I'm not yawning. You guys probably haven't seen me yawn yet, which is totally different. I was up at 6 a.m. this morning because my nose is just raw, but we'll get to that in a minute. So there's some samples. Um, this one's another perfume samples. Um, one thing I do support is making sure people have sunscreen, so I will likely be putting that one in a giveaway. I have another one here that's 60. Um, I think I might actually put that this one in my purse so that I constantly have sunscreen with me. Um, just one that's under the nose, actually, and it sits like on a pillow. Um, so then I, I'm actually putting all of these in my giveaway too. So these will go in some of them in my makeup and some of them in my um, skincare. And I got the this. I kept some, but I kind I threw it like I put a lot of my. Um, so those are going in my skincare for right now. I'll. Um, and my daughter is calling. I'm not sure why she's calling for me, but. I'll go up in a minute. Um, I guess mine's like an EPAP because it's automatic. It's a beautiful machine. Let me tell you. It is so... Um, yes, I kept some of that. It's so light. Like, I don't hear it at night. Um, my fan broke, so 
it is now my sleep machine, which was really hard for me to sleep. So, but yeah, this morning I woke up, my nose is raw just from the rubbing, so I've got to get the polysporin out. I've gotten so many pimples in here, it's not even funny. Um, just, it's it's crazy. I'm, I'm not dreaming as much lately, but I was dreaming at the beginning. I'm still not getting into deep um, REM sleep, but I am sleeping better. Um, Lucas has says that he doesn't hear me at all at night. Um, so I was doing um, 60, I was, I, I would have 64 events an hour and now I'm down to two, two and a half um, events an hour, um, which is absolutely amazing. That's let, cause you're supposed to have five events or less. So, um, yep. Yeah. Absolutely. Go ahead. Um, if you, um, I have you on Facebook too, right? So, um, you can, uh, if you, I'll keep an eye out for your stuff and I'll share it out there as well. Um, but yeah, um, I can switch out the, the mask within the month. So I'm trying to give this a two, a good solid two weeks to see, cause I really like the fact that it just sits under my nose. It doesn't sit over my face. Um, I got the upgrading tubing because they didn't have the regular, so mine's copper line, which is really nice. Um, the f first or the second night, I actually ran out of water, so I had to fill up my water thing. I just think I was so dehydrated. Uh, now it's not so bad. Um, but yeah, so I, um, I don't know how to explain it, but um, I'm on my period and I'm not feeling sick. So I don't know if it, if that is actually helping. I'm really hoping it is. The Aurora ring, no. Um, I find I, w I I find sometimes when I try to medicate myself, like edibles or something, my anxiety comes out with full force and it fights it. So like um, when I had edibles, I had a severe sleep par paralysis, which <laughs> I've had as a reoccurring nightmare but it's like I know I'm asleep and I'm trying to wake myself up from the sleep it's not that I'm awake and not moving it's it's I'm dreaming about it um which is a whole nother level of weirdness like I can't just do something right I have to do it whacked out but, um I know um I kind of want to say a shout out to um Nicole or Nicoletti. Um, I know she's having a really rough time. If you guys could just send her some warm and positive thoughts. Um, I know she's not here right now. She usually watches, she re watch it. Oh, okay. I was on an amitriptyline for a very long time, um, but uh, my body got very well used to it. I was on it for my pain condition in my right arm, um, my CRPS. Um, which is now in full rem remission. Um, I'm on no medication whatsoever right now, except for an antacid and my iron. And I find that those two things I absolutely need to keep up with right now. I'm hoping that uh, in the next few weeks, I'll be able to change up my diet, lose some weight, and then maybe get off my um, antacid. But right now with the things going the way they are where I work, um, just, I'm at my stress levels and I'm not pushing myself over them because I don't want to like, you know, I don't want to do like, I don't want to put too much of my body and then have it give out. So I, I try to not over tax it. So, okay. So, so far so good. Um, I'm enjoying it. I am. Infusion therapy, what for? If you don't mind sharing. Um, oh, uh, by the way, just, yeah, if you guys can send out some warm, positive thoughts to Nicoletti. Um, she's having a really hard time right now. Um, something personal. I don't know. Um, I don't really want to spe spell, like, say anything in case I'm not supposed to. Um, I know she emails me what's going on. And then to Beverly, who's working tonight, she said she'd watch the... Um, 
live later. She is um, an ER nurse. She's one of the people that has won one of my boxes and is, says she likes coming home and watching my shows because like my lives and whatnot because it kind of brings her down to you know like just something fun to do so you guys are part of that too so yeah um i know it's getting into an hour holy crap okay so let's let's show you guys i'm really excited for these two items so i got the clinical smart repair yep so I have a slip disc in my back, which is probably nothing like the, the degenerative. So every once in a while, if I go, like if I like go to do something and I lean back too far, I can feel my bones hitting each other in my back and whoop. That makes me so sick. I don't know why. So yeah, no, I'm, yeah, no, no. Um, this is a moisture surge, hydrating, supercharged concentrate. Yeah, no, no, no. My doctor won't send me for surgeries. Um, when I was a kid, um, oh, there she is. So, um, I was just saying that, uh, you were, um, you were going through some things and that, um, Everyone's sending their love to you so that when you rewatch the beginning or get to this part, you'll see. It's funny because you just popped on and everyone else is just saying how much they, you know, they're sending you their love. Um, I didn't say what was going on. I just said that you were going through something very hard and difficult right now. So, um, but these two look absolutely amazing, like pink and purple. How funny is that? Um, Right now, I am using the Juvian's and the Fat. Like, I kind of will pick one or the other to use. And then, like, at night, night I'll pick one or the other. Uh, the Fat Toner from um, Fenty. And I really like it. Don't think I'll buy it. I really like the Juvian's because it's a little bit of everything. So, it's a cleanser. It's a toner. It's a, um, a, a bit of everything. So, I really like it. But look at this. This thing is huge. So it's clarifying lotion twice a day, exfoliator. Um, I'm excited for that. So I know this is a seven day scrub cream rinse off formula. So, so I wonder what, what is step one? Does someone just, just say which one is step one? Because that's step three. So I got the eye cream, which is all about the eyes. I love the color of that. And then the, I know I think um, somebody sent me an email saying that this is their their lifesaver. Um, oh yeah, I kept this from one of my little things. But um, <laughs> do they? Yeah, I'm actually, um, how do I, like, sometimes, like, I have a few more skincares coming, but um, as as Andrea remembers, um, at the beginning of the pandemic, I did a flash sale. I was hoarding a lot of things, so, like, I was trying to get the whole collection of Sunday Riley, and then I was going to use it, but then when I got close to getting it all, I found one more piece I had to get, so I wasn't using it. So at the beginning of the pandemic, people were having stash sales and I had a sale and I made a thousand dollars from it. I had Sunday Riley. I had, I, I had like anything high end and I realized like I wasn't going to get through it. Like even if I used one, like one thing for a month, I still had enough to last me forever. So I promised myself I wouldn't get back into that because I spent a lot of money to get it. So did I necessarily make all my money back? No, I didn't. But I had a lot of fun collecting it and then packing it up and shipping it out. So I made myself a promise that I wouldn't get that far ahead. So I've actually had to throw out some skincare stuff because I've had it sitting in my closet for about two, two years now. Um, 
so I'm just like enough's enough buy what you can buy you know don't I don't mind buying um like moisturizers here and there um because I am using them now I am washing my face twice a day I am moisturizing and I'm doing this and I've also found that um I have a different day cream than night cream so my night cream is this Charlotte Tilbury and then my day cream right now is the uh, moisturizing barrier cream from Bioderma I think it is right now and um So anyway, I'm going to be using this. Now, whether this will be like, most of this stuff I'll probably be able to use just as one single twice a day. Um, Andre, you could probably tell me. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm assuming so. So I might actually just do like do it once a day, like, you know, keep it for the night routine and use something else. So right now my day um, routine is... Um, what was it the uh so i was using this dravectin anti-wrinkle cream and that stuff is gorgeous it is so thick and luxurious oh so good and then i was using the fenty toner um and then um the glow uh the glow for spf after everything um and right now i've got through my glam glow eye stuff so then i'm going to move to my cover girl so um because i've got to give that a try um and then yes and then at night i would use i'm using my drunk elephant and um the ct plus the glam glow um and then i'm using also using another eye cream in between everything so just to kind of keep it up i will say that these when i was on the doll 10 skincare like i had all the pieces for it i absolutely loved it i thought it worked very cohesive um there's a three piece set right now and it's $133 American for all three pieces, but it's on sale for $79. I don't have, you can't use my code, but you can use my link where if you purchase it, I would get credit for it. Um, it is amazing. The retexturizing pads, which Tracy has sent me, I've, so I've used them twice. I love those. So I tend to use them after I've given my face a wash so that I can feel how clean it is. Like, and it will show me, um, I used their indigo cream for a while for my night cream. And yes, it's really nice. Um, but this CT magic cream, magic dream cream, whatever it is, it's going to be a tough one to give up. I'm halfway through the jar and I've been using it since I got it. So, um, yeah. And I mean, you don't need a lot. I literally dip my finger in and I just get a little bit on and a little bit goes a long way. I find it's very moisturizing and it lasts me all night and then when I get up I you know I get my kid up and then I go upstairs and I wash my face and I have a lot of fun doing that in the morning she sometimes comes up and kind of watches me I'll do that I'll probably what day is today Wednesday I have to get up early tomorrow maybe on see what my Sunday schedule is looking like but yeah um but this one this is um now my docket um i did list the things i did get what did i do with them now you know what i just realized i got this and i put it away and i forgot all about it this is the um positively light tinted moisturizer um from rare beauty so i've got to use this um yeah, because I was thinking more in the summer, we'll have a lot of fun with doing tinted moisturizers, and that's it. But yeah, this, I have to say, um, using this, this and this together, really, and not overusing this, <laughs> like I did on the last video, just lightly using this with this. Until I got this machine, I couldn't do do it. Nope, nope, nope. But I should um, call it a night. I do have to get up early and uh, yeah, I'm starting to get a little tired now. Just, I'm trying to round up all the stuff that I'm taking upstairs with me and putting it in a, 
Yes, that's my that will that'll be my uh video this week. So maybe I'll do like um the yellow the yellow eyeshadow with like make it like um what is what is that called? Uh, the no makeup makeup look. Okay. Yeah, this is over an hour so. Um okay guys. Uh oh, secret word. You guys want a secret word? Oh jeez. What what is uh you did um we could do rare, just um, the secret word will be rare. So RMU giveaway at gmail.com. Let it be May in the subject line. And then um, then just put in the word rare. Um, and then if you want to leave me your YouTube name, um, if I don't know who you are, I know a lot of you already. So but we'll leave it at that. Well, the very last thing I do is that okay guys have a good night don't forget to give this video a like and i'll see you on the next video